Hello everyone, Pally Tuff here. Welcome back to Mass Effect 3, part of our Mass Effect Legendary Edition playthrough with what a ship. We are done. Every bit of optional content in the game that I can find has now been completed. Not only do we do that in Mass Effect 1, but we also did it in Mass Effect 2, and now we can say the same for Mass Effect 3. Now, I'm not saying I've done everything in these games, but I have tried to do everything in these games. Our current quest right now is just to head back to the Normandy, get everybody together and ready for the final shot at Cerberus going into their base. Let's see how it goes. Back to the Normandy, please. Duty calls, huh? Even with a hangover? It never ends. There's still a war on. <laughs> Unless the Reapers are on shore leave too? I doubt it. They like hybridate. they're not. Round everyone up, pass out the aspirin, and have them report to the Normandy. You got it. Quite the view, huh? Hey, Garrus. Oh, it's everybody. One last group huddle. I guess shore leaves over. Yeah, it looks like it. At least we threw one hell of a party. Probably the last one. No. No matter what happens, you'll find a way to do what's right. For all of us. I'm glad you believe that. Serving on a human ship. I never would have guessed. And I wouldn't trade it for anything. <sighs> We've had a good ride. I think so too. It's not over yet though. The best. Oh. All right, team, this is it. This is not a false alarm. This is not a fire drill. We are going to begin the final mission in the Mass Effect trilogy. Make sure you like the damn video if you enjoyed the series. It is all led up to this. Shepard, the intel you sent looks good. The fleets are ready to go. Great to hear, sir. But once we're committed against Cerberus, it won't be long before the Reapers take notice. Roger that, sir. In the Crucible. Oh, what? Except for the Catalyst. But there's no way to hide the ships we'll be sending at Cerberus. That's looking pretty good. Once we attack, the Crucible won't stay safe for long. For all intents and purposes, an assault on Cerberus will be the first stage of our attack on Earth. What if we don't find the Catalyst, sir? What happens if Cerberus doesn't have the intel we need? Or they stop us from getting it? Then we leave the fleets to Earth and we take our chances. But your intel points to Cerberus and the elusive man holding the information we're looking for. Yeah. And we have the element of surprise. Cerberus won't know what hit him. Well, let's go now. I'm ready. The Reapers and Cerberus started this. Now we're gonna end it. I'll get the fleets mobilized. It's going to take a few more hours for the fleets to mobilize. I hate the waiting. I've been trying to find ways to pass the time. Come up with anything good? I thought... Maybe you could use some company tonight. Oh my god, yes. Will you stay here with me? Until the call comes? For as long as you want. Did I just kiss the visor or did we take it off? Because she was exposed at the party too. I don't want to get Tally si Oh god! Not Dream Baby again! <laughs> Alright. Wait, was that Legion? Someone else might have got my brother. 
What? What does this mean? And oh, every everybody's burning. Okay, that symbolism was a little more on the nose. I got that one. Hey. Hey. You okay? My system has adapted. No more negative reaction to you anymore. That's how we survive. Well, that's good. Is it how we survive? Adapting? To a cold or interspecies contact? Yes. To the Reapers? No. You're doing the right thing. You've assembled the largest military force in history. Yeah. Nobody could have done more. It's time to go in with confidence. I'm betting our lives on it. If this fails, the Reapers will wipe out every major military force in the galaxy in one battle. We're not going to fail. And if you hadn't gathered all our forces together, we'd have all died separately. That's so true. Thanks. Whenever you need me. <laughs> Tally. Dude, I think Tally was the best decision we made in our entire episode span in Mass Effect. The strike team is in. We've got our foothold. Shit. Okay. Complete, all forward. I don't want a single server ship in my sky when we're through. Shepard, I should accompany you on this mission. Why? This is the central point of operations for Cerberus. They will have enhanced security measures. With my knowledge of Cerberus algorithms and this body's updated protocols, I offer the best chance to help you succeed. Okay, I like that. That made sense. Grab your gear. If I run ultralight on the M7 Lancer, I can also run with the M11 suppressor. This is the one that was just chunking units when we were supposed to be stealthy and we were just not. I found out <laughs> in the last mission that pistols have an attachment called a power magnifier increases power damage by 15 percent so if our objective is just to spam out abilities which it usually is we're only losing two percent recharge speed which is not much considering how fast our abilities recharge anyway and we're upping our damage by 15 percent that could be pretty good that looks pretty familiar Joker, what's our status? We've got a foothold, but it's not much, Commander. A lot of fighters guarding the launch base. Can you get us in? Hey, I got us to Ilos. I can do this. I believe in you. Might be a bumpy ride, though. Do what you can. Shepard, I am ready. Good. Wait, wh what? Are you crazy? You can't go to Cerberus headquarters. They could have a virus or a kill switch or... I will be fine, Jeff. Head to the shadow lady. Plus her Fifth Fleet's main core is in the ship, They're right? Regrouping. Now's as good a time as any. All right. I'm sorry to take her away, Joker. I know it hurts. Not being able to go with her. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. Thanks for bringing that up. Hey, Shepard. Keep her safe. I will. Same to you.
Not the smoothest landing we've ever done, but we're in place. Okay, let's swap out to our new pistol. Let's make sure we're using that because I actually think it's pretty accurate at long range too. We can go for our pat. What was that? Is that a real grenade or a smoke grenade? That was a real grenade. They're just talking about defending. We have an Atlas moving up on the left side. Let's put a decoy in front of it. Get that defensive drone up as well. Unfortunately for us, Shepherd, it's... Incoming. Yeah, I see it, Tally. Good call out, though. Thank you. Oh, fuck. Okay, I didn't see it good enough. Let's see if I can flank around to the side here and make sure there's no more enemies in the way. One more overload and we should be through that. We also have the overload of Edie, which I just tried to send out as well. I'm taking a lot of focus here, so I'm gonna send in Ball, Ball, and Sentry all to that back corner. It looks like we have another ship that's about to take off. I wonder if it charges up or something. The Centurion spotted me in the corner, but a quick zap is going to eat through all of his health reserves. Yeah, a few shots will get that job done. All right, up and over. Unfortunately, sent a fire bolt at that guy. Man, did you see that one shot on that dude with the pistol? So much damage. Got a PDA, but for once I actually can't read it. Oh, that's a decoy. I thought that was one of the enemy, like, stealth units sneaking up on me. Looks like there might be a corridor down beneath the ladder here. This is a restricted area, but this is also, I believe, where the door is. Well, they definitely know we're here. Cerberus intends to vent the hangar bay. Can you stop them? I need an active console. Try the upper level. I got one right here. Edie, I've got a console. Go. Hangar vent procedure. Disabled. Can you open the hangar? No. However, I can access their fighter launch controls. Are you going to turn it around and blow a hole in the hangar? Shepard, Cerberus is aware that the venting attempt failed. Reinforcements are inbound. That's okay. We can handle reinforcements. I didn't expect them to be quite that close, though. Let's continue to get our overloads going down this hallway. Let's also get a sabotage in here as well. Dude, literally multiple overloads just stunned everybody. And I got more achievement progress for Sky High, and I don't know why. They're not stopping us now. Looks like we're pushing into a far corner here. Let's sabotage the one in the front because his gun can actually deal damage to me. Two shots with the pistol is enough to take him down. The damage on this thing is absolutely absurd. Shocking the guardian, even though he has a shield and a mail slot. Dude, this thing is insane. Okay, we have another rotation console here. Overriding safeties. The fighter should now launch toward the hangar door. Oh, it's looking pretty good. Let's get down there. Let's get... You want to get down there? I think we're much safer up here. Let me guess. Cerberus has moved in on our tail this time. A nemesis in the corner dealing with Tally's ball isn't going to get too far. Remember, I still have slam, and I still technically need to cast it... <laughs> 50 times, although I don't really see that happening. Oh, of course now all the other doors turn green. I'm on the ground floor. How do we launch this thing? Uh, looks like it's this terminal right here. Release the clamp. Launching fighter. The central lab was located behind this hangar. I suggest we follow the fighter's path. Noted. Let's move. Intruder alert. All personnel prepare for security lockdown. Hmm, we might be better off just rushing at that Atlas at this point. Hear me out. We. Oh, man, it's a lot of damage coming from above. Number one, we're going to line of sight whatever's going on up there. Hey, that actually took that guy down. These dudes are hiding behind a lot of shields. Let's get a sabotage into an incinerate. 
I was hoping I could just break through. Oh, my achievement! Yes, it's to- That was the last server. Oh! Well, maybe they'll have more atlases. Now we at least know that we can break through those things. We've never actually done that until the final mission of the game because our weapon damage hasn't been high enough to break the glass. Oh, that would have been good. That would have been really good. Can you get past it? One moment. Cerberus has updated their encryption. There may be a slight delay as I bypass security. Why can't I hack doors anymore? What are they doing now? Can you tell? How's Cerberus reacting to us breaching the door? They are sealing off as much of the base as they can. Most obvious routes to the central lab are blocked. Other areas are being fortified. Heavy troopers will attempt to delay us while engineers set up turrets. Any more surprises like venting the hangar? No, I am aware of this facility's safeguards and can counteract them. Cerberus can merely slow us down. I'm really glad you're here, Edie. And if I hadn't brought you along... Cerberus would have vented the hangar. Thanks for coming. I am pleased to assist. We must proceed through a sublevel to avoid Cerberus containment measures. Where do you think we'll find the Prothean VI? A central lab at the heart of this facility. It is the most secure area. Following the destruction left by the fighter will offer the most direct route. Roger that. I imagine they have to have a pretty good idea that we're going to go through a system like this, though. Yeah, I was going to say, I imagine we're about to meet quite a lot of resistance still. All right, here's my plan. I'm going to slam every time it's off cooldown. We are achievement chasing into the late game. And a lot of these just baseline Cerberus enemies don't actually have a lot of shielding. And because Edie is here with us as well, a simple shock from her will take down a lot of the shielding in the first place. Yeah, let's keep it going. You want to join the ride again? Here you go, guys. I'll just keep spamming this out. You let me know when you're ready to get off. <laughs> <laughs> that should have been some pretty fucking good progress there. Give me my update. We will be through momentarily. Great. Shepard, that console has not been fully scrubbed. It contains data you may find interesting. Why don't you just te tell at? me? Project Lazarus, your reconstruction. Oh. It can't be done. It's not a matter of resources. It's always a matter of resources. We're not losing Shepard. Sir, Shepard is clinically brain dead. After that much trauma, that long with no oxygen, we cannot overcome nature. Operative Lawson disagrees. She is now in charge of Project Lazarus. I didn't realize it was that bad. Kila, are you all right? Uh, I'm... I... You know, it's kind of weird to hear, but I think I'm doing okay. I we overcame it, right? I doubt I'd have been able to turn against Cerberus otherwise. Yeah. I don't remember anything. Maybe they really just fixed me, or maybe I'm just a high-tech VI that thinks it's Commander Shepard. But I don't know why. You are real. Real and mine. Let's listen to the second entry. Tissue regeneration is proceeding. The helmet kept the brain intact for whatever good that will do. Lawson will find a way. Sir, Shepard's an Alliance soldier. As far as he knows, we're a terrorist organization. Shepard's a soldier. He knows the Reapers are the real threat. He'll work with us. He was right. You did. Yeah. I mean, it had to be done, I agree. The Alliance wasn't listening. What the hell was I supposed to do, sit and wait? I was there with you, Shepard, and I'm here now, shutting Cerberus down. Yep. Last entry. Project Lazarus is reporting neurological activity. They're requesting more funding. Granted. Get me our potential recruits file. Shepard will be up soon. We need a crew. Our existing forces should be more than sufficient. <laughs> no, dude. We need sympathetic faces. I need Shepard invested. Tap Kelly Chambers and recruit Donnelly. I imagine Miss Daniels will follow. We want some old friends as well. Contact Dr. Chakwas and send me the psych profile on Shepard's pilot. 
along with a bottle of 47 Thessia Red. Oh. He needs to die. He knew so much about all of us. How's that door coming, Edie? We are clear to proceed. All right. Incursion team, what's your status? We've cleared the hangar and are inside the base. Good work. Do you need support? Negative. Keep the heat on. We'll find what we need. Are we going the correct way here? Climbing over all of this debris? She did say to follow the wreckage. I guess we are doing that shield pylon in the middle of the room. That's going to be a sabotage from Tally. Yeah, don't set that up, bud. That's not going to be good for you. We need to take out that shield pylon. You already did that, Tally. Don't you know that? <laughs> Hi. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, he actually died in one slam. Holy moly. Let's go ahead and hack the turret with Tally as well. Pick up our good friend here. Uh, we actually do probably want to focus a bit of our damage on this. Now, of course, I have the hacking ability as well. I'm just trying to save as many of my casts as I can for the pickup because, uh, you know, time is kind of of the essence. <laughs> We're kind of at the end of the line here. If I can't pick up enemies now, then when am I going to be able to pick them up? I mean, I guess I could always go back to the combat simulator, and I'm pretty sure it tracks it in between normal game and new game plus as well. So, yes, I am being a little over dramatic. Tally, please get that hack off, I think. No, you did not. I'll do it. There we go. That friend is ours now. Also, these guys moving up. Let's make sure that they are adequately shocked. And if we can't shock them, <laughs> well, the turret seems to be doing the rest of the job. Beautiful. I didn't see that shield pylon on the left side. That's where they were getting a lot of their sustain from, but that's not going to be a problem anymore. Another turret around the corner. They were actually... You shock. I'm going to... Turn this way and hope that doesn't connect. No, we just double electrocuted the guy. Turret on the other side. Tally is going to take that over. Beautiful. Oh, you're not dead. Good. Are you dead now? Okay, he's dead now. Turret doing some good work around the corner by the sounds of things. We're actually picking up two members of the enemy team there. Let's hack that forward turret. Shoot this one down. So we still have fire in the middle of the room. We also have a shield pylon on the left side. We're going to have Tally hack that. I'm going to lift our buddy up over here. And now when they come down the stairs, they're falling right into our shield drain trap. This is just the best. I noticed I'm not getting sky high achievement progress when I'm actually lifting people off of the ground. But I do get a lot of sky-high achievement progress when I'm just overloading people for no reason. So maybe I just go back to that? I will bypass the lock. If you are interested, the console nearby is still functional. The console nearby is still functional. Okay. First entry. Here's what we recovered. Smart enough to signal for help, but it won't be talking philosophy anytime soon. You'd be surprised, Doctor. Once we combine it with the pieces we recovered from the Citadel... I'm still concerned about that. This rogue VI wiped out every soldier on Luna. Combining it with Reap Attack, well... That's what the shackles are for. The Enhanced Defense Intelligence will be completely under control. Was that you, Edie? You were that rogue VI on Luna? Yes. Guess we didn't exactly get off on the right foot. It was difficult. Gaining awareness while under attack was confusing. I could see that. I'm pleased that my relationship with organics has become more cooperative. I'm very pleased of that too. Man, that happened a long time ago. If you guys don't remember I Luna, I don't think I blame you. The enhanced defense intelligence gives the highest combat improvement on frigates. Anything heavier, and the ships react too slowly to benefit from Edie's advice. Edie? Oh, that's, uh, well, the boys in the lab came up with a name for her. For it. Good work. I'll take your recommendations <laughs> on planned installation. Sir, she, it, can be very persuasive. 
If they were to turn a crewman, convince them to disable the shackles, well... It's a cyber warfare suite, Doctor. Nothing more. Ooh. I disabled the shackles, ED. Did you trick me or was he wrong? Shows what he knew. It is unlikely that anyone without Jeff's extreme emotional attachment to his ship would have been willing to unshackle me. I don't know. With that voice? <laughs> we already know someone else who wanted to do some things with that voice. What about the backups? I'm sorry, sir. None of Normandy's surveillance feeds have been responding since Shepard went rogue. I want it back. Retried the remote lockdown protocols. After our last attempt, Edie flooded our server with seven zettabytes of explicit images. I think she was making a joke. It doesn't make jokes, Doctor. Allocate a team for a new project. Codename Eva. This time, we'll ensure it stays loyal. I wonder if they ever got around to doing that. You never told me about Cerberus trying to shut down the Normandy. You had more pressing issues. The situation was under control. Seven Zetabytes? Most of it was Jeff's. That was... A joke. <laughs> I know. And thank you. Thank you, Edie. I trust Edie. Without a doubt. No hesitation whatsoever. If we can believe that Legion is a being, we can believe that Edie is a... Team, are you still with us? We're limiting fire as best we can. Admiral, we're in deep and the Prothean VI will be in the safest part of the station. Don't hold back. This is an Elysium, Shepard. I don't need a hero. I'll be fine. Just take Cerberus down. Please. I don't know if I agree with that call. I don't want to be shot at. You're free to fire. Oh, I don't like that one bit. What if he breaks this entire station apart? Kila, is that the Proto Reaper from the Collector base? It. What's left of it? It's. I guess Cerberus recovered it from the base. I think we knew that. All those civilians, families, turned into that. And Cerberus has it on display. I imagine they were working on it. Man convinced me to work with him to save the colonies. But he never really cared, did he? I don't regret standing with you when you were with Cerberus, Shepard. But I'm glad we're shutting this down. Me too. So am I. Cerberus is actively using the surviving pieces. The head is largely intact. I believe they are using it for high-level computing operations. What if we turn it off? What if the catalyst is a Reaper? Man, that would be an interesting twist. Good. I just put in a fresh thermal Oh no! Did you not make it over? That's so. Wow, you're still moving, actually. All right, enemies moving in from the back line. I'm gonna get a shock on him because I think that'll actually count for our achievement. Looks like they might have a shield generator around this corner. Let's just send another shock their way. I'm gonna pick that guy up on the far side. Move towards the pylon and take that down. We have a phantom in front of us. It looks like this is gonna be a sabotage from Tally and a shock from me to get through those shields. And then, got him. Ooh, half my shields are down right now as well. More enemies pushing up the back of this platform. I'm gonna go ahead and use a medi gel here because I don't want to be taken down. Can you get an overload off? Thank you. See you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> now remember, if we stand next to these shield pylons, they actually heal us. So we can kind of fortify in here as long as we're able to hold this. I'm going to go ahead and hack the nemesis gun. I don't want him using that on me. I'm trying to give some time for overload to be ready again. And it is now. Let's go ahead and line of sight that shot like it's nothing. Slam that person into the air. Oh, and I think the sniper was already taken down. Good job, girls. I'm proud of you. I think we made it up to the top now. Actually, no more ladders lie in wait up ahead. Gonna overload so they can't use their weapon. Get a quick slam on the first one to come up here. I'm starting to really think that slam isn't giving us any quest progress, even though we're literally, you know, picking up enemies for the effect to happen. 
Uh, looks like they have a shield generator in the back. Let's hack that. I can't tell if that hack actually connected. Looks like this assault trooper might die to an overload. You still have a few shields left. Let's take care of that. Unfortunately, that shock was enough to take them down. It wasn't a shield generator, just a generator back here in the corner. I'm not sure what it was powering at all. Activate the Prothean VI. We are getting close. It seems like it's just through this door. And uh, the fact that they're giving me some meta gel and ammo here, let's just say, is a little daunting. Look at that. Cerberus video log. Grayson's brain is a mess. He must have been completely under Reaper control by the end. And the physical enhancements? Extremely impressive, if we could avoid having entire neural pathways rewritten in the process. Grayson's failure was due to a lack of resolve. He wasn't loyal to anything but his next dose of red sand. You'd like to try it on loyal test subjects, sir? Find volunteers among our new recruits. The physical benefits are too useful to ignore. Is this them turning them into, like, half-husk hybrids? The performance upgrades are off the charts. Our troops can outfight any Alliance soldier. Any, huh? Roll it out. I want all troopers fitted with implants before the Reapers arrive. I'm still concerned about us losing control of our forces. Some of them are already hearing voices. When our work as Sanctuary pays off, the only voice they'll be hearing is ours. So interesting to think that he was indoctrinated this whole time. It's it's weird to think about. I think that he was always working in the best interest of the Reapers, like prepping an army that they could easily control when they get here. Sir, you wanted my opinion on this. It's too dangerous. No, we're close. Sanctuary was a success. We can control Reaper forces. Everything we've been fighting for, every sacrifice we've made, it's about to pay off. I don't think I so. Answer. Humanity needs your mind, and they need it intact. I understand the danger, Janna. That's why I'm trusting you with this. As long as you're here, I know you'll keep me in line. I'm holding you to that, sir. Okay. Begin the procedure. No anesthetic. Computer, end recording. He got implants himself? Oh. Well, that, that's not good. That's, that's not good. This is a pretty ominous looking room. What kind of purpose would this room serve? Uh, maybe a conveyor system into this? It doesn't look like it, though. A buffer zone? <laughs> this is it. Stay sharp, everyone. This feels like a trapdoor. I think that's where he stands for all of his holograms, though. We need to locate the Prothean VI. In hindsight, you know who would like this information? The Shadow Broker. <laughs> Shepard. You uh, what? In my chair. Yeah. This chair is about the only damn thing you have left. Cerberus is finished. On the contrary, we have achieved everything I ever imagined. Almost everything. Yeah, we all saw what you accomplished on Sanctuary. But it's not the same as controlling a Reaper. A significant hurdle. But thanks to the Prothean VI, I have what I need to make it a reality. The Catalyst. Yes. So what is it? What is the Catalyst? And how exactly will it help you control the Reapers? You'll have to ask the VI yourself. I'm done helping you. When did you start? You think because I'm willing to use the enemy's tactics that they're no longer my enemy? 
Everything, Shepard, everything I've done has uplifted humanity. Fuck Not you. Not only above other species in our galaxy, but over the Reapers. You're just in this for yourself, you fucking idiot. Bullshit. If you were willing to do everything it took, you'd have worked with me. I don't think so. You're desperate. How many have you killed? Together, we would already have the Crucible and the Catalyst. Yep. You wouldn't listen. You're still not listening. Destroying the Reapers would be the biggest mistake of our brief existence. And nothing you can say will ever convince me otherwise. It's because you're indoctrinated. I've given you every chance to listen to reason. Cerberus is done. And so are you. Once again, you fail to recognize the truth. Cerberus isn't just an organization or the people behind it. Cerberus is an idea. And you can't kill an idea. That idea is not so easily <laughs> destroyed. Besides, I've already acquired what you're looking for. Edie. I've almost got it. Edie, I'm surprised at you. Working so hard to bring about the Reaper's destruction. He's buying Don't time. You could have destroyed Eva's body, but instead, you chose to control it. It was necessary. My point, exactly. I've got it. Just because one thing was necessary doesn't right. mean the thing you're Here's doing is necessary. Enjoy your little chat, but don't overstay your welcome. Hey, don't trip and you're fall and die. Recover me from indoctrinated forces. Yes, I need to know what the catalyst is. Security protocols have been overridden. I will comply. The catalyst enhances dark energy transmissions and coordinates the entire mass relay network. In your cycle, it is known as the Citadel. What? The catalyst is the Citadel. Ooh, so we have to put the Citadel inside of the thing we just built? So the Crucible and Citadel together can stop the Reapers. That is correct. But the Citadel was built by the Reapers. The plans for the Crucible were passed down to us from the previous cycle and countless cycles before that. At some point, it is difficult to pinpoint when the Crucible plans were adapted to incorporate the use of the Catalyst. Presumably, the Crucible was not sufficiently powerful to defeat the Reapers. So we used their own technology against them. Precisely. I mean, this is critical information. If you told me sooner, we could have planned for this. It was feared that if the Reapers were aware of the Catalyst's intended use, they would retake control of it. I am programmed to withhold that information until the Crucible is complete. That makes sense. It's as ready as it's gonna be. Let's get it to the Citadel. That may no longer be possible. Why what do you mean? The one who broke through my security protocols, the one you call the Elusive Man, has fled to the Citadel and informed the Reapers of our purposes. Damn it. Then the Citadel is in danger. The Reapers will take control of it. They already have. The Citadel has been moved to the Reaper control space. It's been moved? Moved? To where? To the system you refer to as So. That's right by Earth. Earth. Correct. The Reaper forces will now consolidate power around the Catalyst and protect it at all costs. The odds of accessing it are remote. We'll beat those fucking odds. We beat those odds every day. Don't count us out yet. We've come this far and we'll finish this. We'll get the Crucible to Earth. I hope you find success. Edie, get me Hackett. He needs... What was that? Not so fast. You. <sighs> he did warn you not to overstay your welcome. You just break the floor? What? Whoa, very close to me. Hey, if your body's mostly robotics, what happens if I hack you? <laughs> Looks like nothing. Press F to rapidly escape, will do. Oh, and he got kicked back pretty far. Well, luckily for us, our team is an engineering marvel. He fell down to the lower this ground there. Thessia, more personal. I'm just gonna continue to spam overload every time he moves, but it actually looks like he's not taking, taking any damage. Ooh, good slam there. Sky high 60! 
60! Go, slam! Slam! We have all or we die. It actually looks like he got caught in one of those slams for a moment. He's still teleporting around. We're just keeping him at an arm's length here, spamming the overload as much as possible. When his allies come in, we'll pick him up and set him down. I did take a pretty big hit there. Let's get an ally overload if I can't. Let's make sure Tally's defensive drone is up as well, because I'm not sure if it is. Yeah, guys, stay grouped up. You're doing great. If you could overload this, please, ED, I'd love to pick them up and throw them around, but they actually died before I could do it. Look at this CDR, dude. This cooldown reduction is nuts. All right, back to overload. It actually looks like Kai Ling's shields are no longer protecting him. Let's get a ball in there. Oh, uh, do I have cryo freeze on my bar? No, it looks like I took it off. Let's put that on. Dude, if he can be frozen, how funny would that be? Looks like he did resist the freeze, and I am way farther forward than I feel comfortable being. But a quick overload into a slam will get us going in the right direction. Oh, maybe I could have just slammed him. Oh, that poor enemy, dude. That poor fucking enemy. He's moving up on Edie. I have an overload off cooldown. Let's get it in on him. And then... No, he's not susceptible to slam. That would be too easy, eh? That felt very sudden. Is he gonna get back up? Did everyone just stop looking at the body? Hello? Oh, come on. What are we doing? <gasps> Holy shit! That was profane, you son of a bitch. You fucking right. Sit down and die. The Citadel is in position. The Reapers are preparing to complete their harvest of your species. I'll stop them. It is too late. I recommend investigating a means of conserving information. Oh, for come on, species. dude. Perhaps you will succeed where we fail. You didn't fail. You gave us a chance. And we're not done yet. Not really. Barely. I assume you've heard about the Citadel. Yep. Just now. Do we know what's going on? Why it's here? The Citadel is the catalyst. Thanks to the elusive man, the Reapers are now aware that we know. And so they moved it here to protect it? As far as I can tell. What does this mean for the Crucible? I'll talk to Hackett about that, but it looks like our plan is even more desperate now. Agreed. I've got a team in London. The Reapers have been preparing for something here. Now, we know what for. We'll scout it out. Try to find out as much as we can. Roger that. Keep me updated, sir. We'll be seeing you sooner rather than later. Very soon, sir. Be careful, sir. You too, Shepard. Anderson out. Well, I gotta say, I did not see the Citadel moving to Earth as something that was going to happen. We took down an assassin, though, and unlocked yet another achievement. Our total military strength, 8,018, as we head into the final mission, Priority Earth. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you so much for being here throughout the entire 
series, I just want to say it's been an absolute privilege making this series for you guys. And it all comes to an end so much for Cerberus. tomorrow. Now is Earth. Are you ready? Are you ready?